There's a spiky MK2 enemy here in the final. There's also some graphic changes here and there that may not be obvious, unless you have really good memory and an eye for small details, or if you compare both versions side by side. Although some of the details that were changed were so small that I don't see what was the point in changing them in the first place. <laughs> Heart tank isn't here either. Let's see if I can make it up there. wall that blocks the way to the armor upgrade capsule isn't here and neither is Dr. Light to help you out. And same goes for all the other stages. There are no armor enhancements to pick up in this build at all. However, I was able to access them through action replay. But X in his armor upgrade isn't complete in terms of sprites as you'll see in a little bit. Let's start with the arm enhancement and use that with the boss weapons. But first I'll need to make a safe state since some of them make the game freeze. Charging the lightning web works, but doesn't quite work like the final, as some enemies seem to go right by it. <laughs> Charging the frost tower is a bit tricky though. First you have to select and charge a weapon that doesn't crash the game and lets you switch uh, via on our buttons then cycle back to the frost tower and release the charge all it does though is shoot a single x buster shot which does uh, multiple hits you can only do this once and the game will no longer let you shoot it or change weapons so let's go back to the save state charging the soul body works but there are some graphical glitches and some of the colors seem to be a bit off Charging the rising fire here doesn't do anything but this weird pose. And notice how he seems to grow another arm for a brief second. 
if you move, X will hold out his buster without shooting. Charging the ground hunter here is useless as it only shoots a single X buster shot which doesn't seem to do damage to anything. Charging the aiming laser seems to work but not as well as it does in the final. Charging the double slam clone seems to work, but I haven't been able to damage anything with it. And charging the twin slasher is a waste of time in this build because it will only shoot a single shot, which seems to be a multi-hitting one, but it doesn't damage anything I've tried it on so far. And on top of that, it disables your weapons, including your X-Buster. So right now, I can't even shoot anymore. Let's load the save state. I'll enable the rest of the armor enhancements. When you do this though, you will see some glitches in some of X's armor sprites as all the graphics for it don't seem to be fully implemented into this build. Oh, and uh, references to the Nova Strike do seem to be in the game code, but I haven't been able to access it, probably due to the lack of a Giga Attack button. Having the leg enhancement or even the full armor in this build doesn't allow you to hover in the air like you can in the final. You can only air dash. And as for the enemy layout for the remainder of the stage, it's completely different from the final as you'll see through the annotations. It's stages such as this one which is one of the main reasons why I'm playing the game at such a slow pace. If you were to take a quick glance at this stage as a whole and then compare it to the final, it probably would look pretty much the same but it does have its differences. One thing that does stand out immediately is one version of an enemy which is not in the final at all, which you'll see in a little bit. Blaster Aster doesn't appear in the final at all, and it was replaced with a uh, Metal Gabriel, which don't make an appearance in this build on any stage. And this Gold Blaster Aster seems indestructible as I've tried every single weapon on it, even the charged versions, and it doesn't damage it one bit. <laughs>
I might as well enable this now since I didn't get a chance to do it in the last stage. And it's the X Buster enhancements, which both of them seem to be here. The first one is for the one that lets you have up to four charge shots. And the second one sh is the large plasma shot, which seems to be unfinished. I'll show that one in a little bit. Let's start off with the first one. second X Buster enhancement which is very unfinished. There's practically no graphics for it when you shoot it. And there's apparently no color palette for X's arms as they'll turn into a black shadowy like figure. And the shots apparently can only hit one enemy at a time as opposed to hitting multiple enemies at once. <laughs> There is a hard tank here in this tree stump. There doesn't seem to be any way to get it since the rising fire has no effect on it. Switch back to the regular X Buster.
This web doesn't quite track you like it does in the final. He can also shoot one that doesn't stick to you momentarily, and when you decrease his energy a bit, he'll start throwing out two of them at once. And that's something I've never seen him do in the final. <laughs> I 